If he gets like another discard card, I'm gonna freak out. There's no way, right? There's no way he gets another discard card. I messed up, chat. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, 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 no! Oh, I played the wrong card! Oh my god, wait, what? We lost. Guys, it's okay. It's okay, chat. This is so sad. <laughs> it was bugged! I went 100% full papaya, chat. Please develop. Come on. No! <laughs> he didn't develop, chat. <laughs> See you later, buddy! Let's go! Alright, brand new deck, boys. Brand new deck. This deck right here, I kid you not, is 0-0 at the moment. My current version of the deck is 0-0. So, with this 0-0, let's see how far we can climb. GP is better than Misfortune. Yeah, but Miss, I, I really have so many Plunder cards that Misfortune activates Plunder so well. I'm still a winner. Guys, I'm 0-0 at the moment. This is very similar to what Mogway's running. I don't know what his list is. We built this from scratch, but it has to be very similar. Like, there's no way we're not running the same cards. This is really strong. One pass three, right? Play the Mogwai version. I haven't seen the Mogwai version. Hey there. Mind the knife. Thermo here is really good for us. So this is, this is Zoe's nightmare, basically. <laughs> this is Zoe's nightmare. That's not bad. I like these cards a lot. Playing Mogwai decks again? Yes, sir. Every day, man. Every day that I can, I will pl I'll play Mogwai decks. I'm going to go for this. Reason is I have a great blocker for, for this now. Hey. Thanos Frog, thank you for the resub for six months, my man. I appreciate that a lot. Thank you very much, sir. That is uh, very, very kind of you. I appreciate it. He might pale cascade for this. That's what I'm really looking for here. If he doesn't pale cascade, I don't care. I get a very good trade. Thank you, Thanos. Can't believe it's been half a year since I subbed to you. Keep up the great papaya streams. I'll try my best, brother. Thank you for the support, as always. Thank you for the continued support, man. I'm going to pass here. I don't know if I have to play this or not, if he has removal for this. He's never not playing Ignition at the very least, so if he wants to burn his Ignition just to burn one more mana for me, I'm okay with it. Now I got I got the value I wanted. Um, It's fine. Now I can play for this for value. Try Draven Zoe deck from Twitter. The dream. It's pretty high value overall. I don't mind this at all because then I can still block Zoe so it doesn't matter. I can even hush Zoe now. One mana kill a Zoe. He's not attacking, guys. I have a blocker. He's never attack. I have a blocker though for Zoe. Why would he attack? I don't know. I, I probably would have killed her. I'm going to regret this. I don't know why I listened. I guess he plays gem here, and then I just chump block, right? Okay, it's even better. Okay, now, now this all makes sense. Now, now it's actually pretty decent for us, I gotta admit. What's he playing around here? Watch him play around the hush. Watch him just pass. Which makes no sense to do, but watch him do it. Oh, nice, 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 nice. Very good. Thank you. Okay. It's pretty nice of him. <laughs> imagine not playing around Hush, chat. Could you imagine not playing around Hush there? Come on. How does he... That's that's just an amateur play. I gotta admit, that's 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 that's, that's amateur amateur hour chat. I'm gonna open attack because of this draw. If I didn't draw this, I wouldn't have open attacked. I'm fine with that. I don't even know why he's so excited. Why are you excited, bro? What's the, what's all the excitement about? Explain it to me. I prefer this. 
Because I, I might get the three cost spell and then I can do all, all of this. Oh, ooh, 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 so much spice. So much spice at once. All right, we're doing this next turn. Give me the three cost spell. Another three cost spell. Uh, I can live with that. I can definitely live with this. Trill of Evidence sucks as a card. Give me the value. Oh! Oh, baby! Give me the value! Ay, 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 ay. Give me the value, boys! Give me the value, chat! Ay, 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 ay. Even more value! I want everything! I want it all! Oh. It's not looking good! It's not looking good, chat! It's not looking good for him! Oh no, dude, I get even more now! I get my other three cost spell. Oh no, chat. Oh, that's a yikes. Oh, that's a yikes, boys. That's a super yikes. Wait, I can just play this, right? Uh... Okay, go, go, go. Come on, come on. I'm gonna wait for more removal. He has more removal. He has all spells, chat. There's no way he doesn't have more removal for this stuff. Here it comes. There it is. All right, ultra value. <laughs> nice hush, bro. <laughs> oh no, dude. Oh no, chat. He lost. Ah, oh, easy win. All right, all right. That's 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 a fun game. Alpha at Omega. All right, dude. This guy is actually platinum too, so he's working his way. Is this a go hard deck? No, it's not. Maybe maybe it is. Who knows? Twisted Fate is always good versus Twisted Fate, because you can kill Twisted Fate on four. Alright, let's 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 get rid of his early game. We don't want him having early game. If he has Black Market Merchant, I'm very happy to get rid of it. Okay, that was okay. That's a really good card to get rid of. That was his active... That was his... Um. Okay, so he's... What is this? An Undying deck? This has to be Undying, right? Like, it has to be. I don't even know. For it found yeah, it has to be undone. Yeah. Okay. Um. Weird champion. Bait for undying. It's pretty much. That's pretty much what it was. Bait for undying. I'm gonna draw some cards. His removal is not going to be very high. He's going to have the challenger removal card, but that's about it. I think I want to get rid of Hunt. I want to play Hunt the Week here. Maybe I should have played Hunt the Week first, but then I couldn't play TF, which is the problem. It's a good time to play it. The reason I like playing it now is because he has uh, the Rally Dude in his hand a lot. Of oh, Hired Gun is a good removal. I'm very happy with that. This has to be right. This has to be the right play. Is he really going to block that with a 3-3? Come on, dude. What are you doing? Why would he ever do that? Okay. Um, next turn, we have a lot of draw if he doesn't have a way to make this vulnerable. Oh, yo, 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 yo. That's so good. That's so good. Okay, okay. Let's draw a card. We can level him up. No, no Kappa. We have one draw, two, three. We have a lot of draw here. Please don't get a challenger thing on my guy. Please don't do it. I have to jump block here. I'm going to have to level this up. I think I lost anyway. I think I'm dead, but we'll try our best. We will try our best. One, two, three, four, five cards drawn. It's enough. Five. This is six, seven. That, that can level. Yeah, this is a level up. I can even, instead of playing this, I can play something else from his deck. That's a really good steal. I guess what I will be playing this. Replacing Hunt the Week for Spell Thief in this deck. I mean, it's probably better, man. It's probably better. But is this Spell Thief on um, uh, Targon? Maybe I'm, maybe I'm wrong here. Maybe, I, 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 th I thought it was Targon. 
No, I, I like stealing his cards this turn because I might not be able to steal them next turn easily. I like this. I like this play a lot better. So we're looking solid. Wow. Okay. I'm, I'm not mad at that at all. I'm going to have blockers, which is nice. And I'm going to do a lot of damage to him as well. That's fine. I have a second one in hand. I think that might be game winning for me. I think that might simply be game winning for me. I'm not sure yet. But I'm going to have a lot of damage coming through as, as well. So I'm pushing three damage. I have two blockers next turn. Like, that's very solid. That's a very solid turn. All right, we have Twisted Fate coming down guaranteed next turn. All right, Twisted. You got a job to do, buddy. Okay. Vengeance. Okay, that's pretty good. So he's, he's spending a lot of mana here. Um, I do want to get value for drawing a card here, and that's about it. It's a very good draw. And I don't want to I don't want to kill these off, I think. Because then next turn I can play Unspeakable Horror for value. So this turn we're playing probably um probably just the monkey idol, I would say. Yeah, monkey idol seems like the best play here. And then we probably um I don't know what we do after after next turn. Because he doesn't have very good blockers here. Do we just open attack? I don't think we do. I want to see what I can steal. Then again, I also like drawing with this guy. I don't know. He can ruin it. doesn't matter. No, he can't. What do you mean? That's a really good draw. Wait, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9... This will give me 10 cards. I need to empty my hand. My hand's too full. Oh no! I play- uh, I played- I played the wrong one. Oh boy. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. I'll play Croker on him then. That's a really good draw. So he ends up blocking, which is good for us. I'm pretty happy with this. Like, we're, we're looking good. We're looking like we can win this. It looks like we can win it. Get bloody, get Makes no difference. Four, four to four. And I have um, Unspeakable Horror if I want to play it. That's really good. That is really, really good. Doesn't make a difference. Do I keep these guys on board? I wonder. I don't even know. I probably do this. This is probably the right play. I think. Because I don't want him to replay this. I, I also do like playing um, Chronicler on this, to be honest. I think it's very solid. Shot first, save it for face, maybe. But I like keeping this alive, and I can't take the 5 damage to face. This is guaranteed face damage as well over multiple turns. Now this hits for too much damage, right? That's 5 damage to face. He's 1 off lethal. And we have lethal next turn off of this, and this. I think this is GG. He, Unless he has like a... I don't know. There's a few cards he could have. I don't want him hitting face ever because he might have the rally card, which is annoying as hell. Runate? What does Runate do, chat? Why do we care about Runate? What, what does Runate do? It does nothing. Runate does nothing. Like, he, he removes nothing from us. You missed the old Rex? Everyone does, unfortunately. He could have Grasp, for example. Grasp is very common in this deck. GG. All right, boys, 2-0. 2-0 with this version. 
I love I love your ideas for bacon. I think it's a very fun deck to play. Um, Barkeep is a lot of fun, but you got to get um, cut grass. But I like having a little bit of healing in this deck, and you need some removal, right? Where Barkeep can generate more removal, but sometimes he just doesn't. You need ways to like survive. Yo, Grappler! What's up, buddy? Witness perfection. Witness perfection, boys. Uh huh. What is what is what is my hand? Yo, what is my hand, chat? Explain it to me. I don't understand. I wish I had the android here. I don't need to discard this yet, but I will. I'm going to look for Neandroid here. Neandroid! Okay. Can live with that. We've got hand refill here. And this is why this this is why I chose this this methodology, chat. He's a 3-4, which means he he can he has to chump block my 2-drop with it, which is pretty good. I'm pretty happy with that. Pretty happy with him being forced to chump block here. I like it. I will take the trade every time, when possible. He is the future, boys. He is the future. Nice. Good trade. Good trade overall. You love that death ray? It's it can be very useful. It can be very, very useful. Now because they're playing back back keep red right us. Oh, we were just a little bit a little bit late for this. Oh, we gotta play this now. We're we're elusives, boys. Elusive lure, yes, sir. We are elusives at this point. Now slow down, will you? You'll find me a formidable foe. Fine. Go ahead. Time to get rowdy. Pretty good damage. That's eight damage to face. So two hits, I kill him, right? Sentinels of light don't fear the dark. Before he can play Lucian, let's kill this off. This will also give me one more damage, which is kind of nice. And now we have refill, right? We can refill our board. He might single combat here, in which case we can just play on back alley, back alley barkeep. That's fine. That's fine as well. Sentinels. I can live with that. I think I will play back all the barkeep this turn and attack with it. I think that's the play. I'm pretty sure it is. I do want to get rid of this because now it's no longer buffing Bark Beast. Might as well just attack with it. Ooh, that's a nice card. It's a nice generator card. I like it. I like it quite a lot. Thank you, sir. Let's party. We're killing him in two attacks here. He has to block this, so he's going to lose his uh, scout attack, which is kind of nice. I'm pretty happy with that. Yeah, this is not bad. And we have good chump blockers for next turn. Like, we only need this guy to hit face. Everything else is just whatever. Alright, let's go back, our back alley. There it is. There it is. What does this generate for us? Okay, okay, I can dig that. I can dig that, chat. So, let's block here. Let's block here. We're down to 2 HP here. Um, Probably blocking like this. 
Wait, no, 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 don't disconnect me. We have lethal on open attack, right? We do. We can buff this by two more attack if we want to. You know what the play here is probably? I don't even know. This is probably it. Death Ray the Shark. No, 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 no. We never Death Ray here. I, I want to save mana for um, Death Ray MK3 for this guy, right? This is the main problem. He single combats with the 3-3 three, three sometimes. He doesn't want to do it with Hecarim. He doesn't want to lose Hecarim, right? So we're, we're playing around that. So we, we have... This is going to buff him anyway. We want to make sure his single combat doesn't go through. That's why we have mana for this. Okay. Nothing I can do about that. Um... This is doing 4 damage to face. It's fine, chat. It's fine. The color is off. We just don't block with this guy and we go down to 1 HP. Guys, we're not dead! We're not dead, chat. I'm not dead, chat. Stop it. Why would I be dead? Hecarim's not leveling here. Hecarim's not leveling, chat. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Yeah, we're fine. Four damage to face. Guys, he can't single combat this turn. And next turn, he's not going to do single combat with this. He's going to do it with this. And next turn, I have death ray to stop any single combat. I have the answer to single combat, chat. Look. Look how good I am at the game. Look how good this is, chat. They're both within death ray stopping single combat. I just attack with Meow... And I win! What unspeakable- That doesn't exist, chat! That card doesn't exist! Stop it! Easy game! You all doubted me! Don't doubt me! How is the night going? Papa! Not bad, Cam. Not bad. I'm um, getting our butts kicked because we're trying new decks. If chat would only let me play my hex tech- Actually, we started off really papaya. I made so many misplays in the first, like, four games of the, of the day. Spell Thief, use your brain. Not often. Sometimes I do, though. I, I have my moments. Pale, uh, yeah, I need Pale Cascade. That's a good point. I should have gotten Pale Cascade for sure. I should have definitely gone for Pale Cascade. I agree. Come on. Where's my one and two drops? Get over here. Well, two drops, actually. I guess I found it. It's fine. How are the games? Really good, man. Thank you for asking. Really, really decent. That's the that's the card I wanted to find, but I didn't find it. I'm having a blast at the moment. All right, so we have Nandroid. We can block. Uh, we can block. He's gonna play Ignition. I'll I'll jump block and Mystic Shot him to death. Right. I think that's the play here. I think that's the play. <laughs> I like that guy. He's pretty funny. He's pretty funny. So, uh, yeah. Um, we'll open up with Mentor here. Hopefully buff him. And if Mentor dies, so be it. It is, it is what it is. Yeah, he has to now kill this off, right? He's got no choice. Looking swell today? Thank you. Yeah, he has to go for the removal. It might even be like a Thermo Beam if I'm lucky. If I'm super lucky, it might be a Thermo. Flock well. I'm not super. I guess I, I guess I'm not super lucky, chat. All right. I'll pass here. Block the generator. Um, I think I was blocking the other guy more often than generator. I'm not sure. I'm not sure which is the better play. All right. So here we play Victor. He's gonna generate cards every turn. Um, and then he can just play Vi the next turn. I could go for this as well. I think I have no choice. I think that's the only play I have. I would like to make this stronger, but at this point, I think I just have to do it. That's not bad. I just wanted three attack. 
That's good enough for me. Next turn we have six. Seven. I don't mind blocking this at all. I can just insta make her 10 with this as well, which is kind of nice. I could open attack as well and not play her and then just play Victor afterwards. That's not a bad play either. Um, then I can just buff the bot, right? For for a lot of freeness. Wonder what my play is here. Like, I, I think that's a good play. I think this is better than playing her. Because she just gets killed by Thermo or something weird. I'd rather play her next turn. Yeah, I, I like this state of board. I like giving this the buff, and he, he wants to block the 1-1 one, one very often. Yeah, I think open attack here is the best play we have. And keeping this alive is pretty nice. I can definitely dig that. Nice. Alright, Victor comes down, and we can level Victor very fast now. With the cards we have in hand. I'm fine with that. I'm thinking, does he have like... Yeah, he can't double Noxian Guillotine, so this is safe. Oh wow, does he have does he have all three of his flocks? Is that even a thing? Does he have all three flocks? That would be crazy. So he was thinking of killing. Okay, fine. It's fine. I can live with that. Um. Pass. I don't think I want to develop this quite yet. That's really good. Wow. Um, so if he spends mana now, I can do this. Vi into this. Do just win with that? Is that like a game winning combo? I think it is. I think that is a game winning combo. What about a Arachnoid Sentry into another flock? I mean, he doesn't have any more flocks, hopefully. I think he would have flocked this if he had it. I think we're looking decent. What's he digging for? I wonder. I'm thinking whether I open with this. I'm just gonna play it now. I, I don't want I don't wanna do this and get stunned by another arachnoid, honestly. Digging for damage first to guillotine, yeah. Well he needs to play it now. Wow. Um this deck has nothing that can kill this now. Because it's not damaged. We do this. No, no, there's no point in buffing this any further, right? We buff one of the elusives, I think. Yeah, yeah, we just win here. There's no way we don't. I don't even need to pull anything in. I, I could have pulled something in. I probably would have pulled in the 3-2. It's whatever. We just win. Okay, GG. Thermo. Thermo. He can't really punish, I know. There's no punish there at all. I'll play Ignition into Mystic Shot. I don't think Get Excited is as good. Like, this deck doesn't run heal, so... So it's, it's a pretty safe play. Juju. Yep. Yeah. Okay, that's one or no. That felt pretty decent. That felt pretty decent. Even though we didn't get any of our combos off, it felt okay. Oh, there's a deck I wanted to build, chat. Oh my... Oh, there's a deck I... W okay, forget this deck. Forget this deck. There's a deck I wanted to build. I forgot about it. Time out, time out, time out, time out, time out. Time out. There's a deck I really wanted to build. Ooh... Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, I'm excited. You'll see in a sec, chat. You'll see what it is in a sec. Is <laughs> Never luck. I probably should have played this, to be fair. Now I have to play Mountain Goat. I gotta play Billy to stop that. To stop his Billy. 
unfortunately. Actually, I could have played Ignition then, man. Neon Cat afterwards. That's fine. I think I want to save my mana. Then again, this is leveling our, our big dude and is giving this guy damage, so it's kind of nice. Alright, what's her play here? In all seriousness, what's her play here? I think the play here is um, Neandroid into double buff on Neandroid. Yeah, hairless apes. Alright, you guys will see the deck after in, in, in a little bit. You guys might enjoy it. So what is this? To get excited to kill this off? Thermobeam, maybe? Talvez? Let's hit him for four. They're both hitting for four. He doesn't have a great play here. It's fine. Matters not. Alright. Uh, Vi is about to level. Vi's leveling is really good here. If he drops a Heimer, do I ever go for this? He's holding on to Heimer, thinking I might have get excited, which he's right about. Wanna know a sad situation? I was playing a Zoe deck against an Ephemeral deck. They used Death Mark to make my Zoe Ephemeral. Well, I used Spell Thief to use Death Mark, and they just spammed Trinda Motes. Sad life. Ooh, that is a sad life, brother. That's what I was waiting for. There it is. All right, now we're good. Because he was waiting for playing his barrier card, like Bastion. That's why he didn't play it last turn. He was waiting for me to drop under three, 3 HP. So... That's what we were waiting for 100%. We're pretty good here. I'm very happy with this. Alright, let's party. There's no reason to attack with this guy. We're good. Party time! Kek W, indeed. It's fine. Oh wow, he doesn't even have it. Nice. So we got the Vi level up, which is really nice. He has another one. Yeah, but he can't play it this turn. That's all that matters. He has to play it next turn. So we're, we're safe. We're very safe. Four out of eight. Eh. I like uh, Solaric Priestess here. He could absolutely destroy a second Heimerdinger. Then again, Mentor is so good as well. I could just play both, actually. Hard to say what the right play is. I don't have enough ways to level up um, our friend Victor. Like, the idea behind Victor leveling was to play um I'm waiting for, like, a static a static shark or something to kill this off. Because he does not want me opening with this. That's his nightmare. That's, that's nightmare fuel chat. Me opening with this guy, buffing this and her. So he's going to play... Oh. Okay. Well, that works. Now we know exactly what we're looking for. Um, I guess we're going to play two units and ignition just to go for the maximum amount of um, board presence. We're just going to max out our board. Flesh was weak, but look at me now. Flesh was weak, but look at me now. All right, we're good. We're good. We're looking really good. A lot of stuff is buffed. We never buff her. We always buff him. Actually, do we always... He has hush. We have to keep in mind he does run hush. So sometimes the better play is just to buff, like, the 3-2, right? To give him no blockers for... I don't know. Maybe buff a 2-3. I think this is the right play. What am I doing? I think this is the right play. Yeah, buff the weakest hitter. I like this. I'm pretty happy with this. He has to block three things. I get to... Okay, double hush. Okay, that's good. So we have double ignition as well. I do like open attacking before he can play cards. Oh, GG. So we were five over lethal. We're good. We're good. All right, that's two wins. I mean, the deck is doing okay. I gotta admit, the deck is kind of doing okay. But still, I'm not leveling my, uh, my victor. Look, see, it's a good deck. 
It's, it's, so it's not my kind of deck though, chat. Like it, it's winning, but it's not my kind of deck. I love you, Mog, but Grappler makes me wet. <laughs> oh no, dude.